Hello everyone and welcome back. I haven't uh, pulled one of these out in a little while, so I figured we'd take a look at another O-Meal. O-Meal's, uh, meal. <laughs> uh, we have chicken creole with brown rice. Uh, brown, brown rice, can't read, and chicken simmered in tomato sauce with celery, green peppers, onions, and more. Zero grams of trans fat, low in cholesterol, and by God, it's a good source of fiber, and it's chicken. Um, I just, I don't know, I picked this up, I thought the, uh, the menu sounded interesting. You know, I've had my, uh, my problems with oatmeal in the past, being a little bit too expensive for what you get. You know, these are essentially just an entree and a heater and a napkin and spoon as you can see by the graphic. But you know, they're, they're, they're fine tasting but you know, you just always wish for more. So this is 230 calories. Uh, there's the rest of the nutritional information for you guys. Hey look, get a little vitamin C. Woo! And uh, you know, a pretty small ingredients list there, which is actually kind of nice. Kind of nice. Um, but you know, aside from that, these are really simple. Very simple meals. They're usually, you know, they usually taste pretty good, but again, uh, it, it's, it's a bit, you know, not, not a ton of food for the price that you typically pay. And I normally buy these on sale on Amazon. Uh, I don't remember what I paid for this one, to be honest with you, so I apologize. I was not prepared. <laughs> uh, but, you know, I normally buy them when they're less than $10. Let me put it to you that way. So, pouches are kind of nice, have a nice little, uh, you know, you can stand the pouch up. Here is our heating element. And they trap that away there. Add three to five ounces of any liquid. Hey, put motor oil in it, it's great. And let steam heat. Let steam, <laughs> let steam. Let steam and heat for three to five minutes. These are pretty energetic heaters, I do like them quite a bit. Here is our pouch of our chicken creole. And it's also a stand-up pouch. And then, as well, you get your uh, accessory pack. You get a little spoon. The spoon is actually pretty sturdy here. It's a, you know, it's a good spoon. Not long, but, you know, it's, it works. Uh, which end did I perforate? <laughs> I perforated it, and there we go. And you get a napkin, which is, you know, just a napkin. Now one nice touch, we do have salt and pepper. Pepper being the operative word today. So let's go ahead and, uh, and get this shindig started. So get our heating element out of its little bag. And generally I just like to stuff this thing just directly down at the bottom and smash it down. That's a pretty big old uh, heating element too. So there we go, heating elements down. At this point I generally like to add the water. And the only reason I do that is because it does take it a second or two to get started. I'm just gonna put that down in there. And then finally, let's put in our ration and we will seal our bag. Let's see if we can hear anything. Uh, well, like I said, it does normally take it a minute or so to get started, but once it does, it's very energetic. So I'm going to let this sit, start up, and then I'll be right back with you. All right, we had liftoff. It got a little messy. <laughs> 
got just a little messy, but I wanted to let you know, I, I promise I wasn't lying. There, that's what the napkin's good for. <laughs> Had a little spillage out of the uh, steam vent up here. But as I hope you can hear, that thing is ripping and roaring and it's nice and hot towards the bottom. So again, I will be uh, right back uh, and we'll plate up the food and uh, try it out. All right, we're back here. So, heater's still going. I don't know if you can hear it. Just a nice slight gurgle. Uh, but the reaction has came down quite a bit. Still have some good steam coming off there. But we're going to go ahead and end this and get our meal out. <clears throat> I'm just going to wipe off the package a wee bit. And then let's try our meal. Now you could eat this directly out of the package, just sit it down, but for the sake of video magic, I'm going to go ahead and put it on the tray. Put it on, put it, there we go, come on. Get the spoon. Uh, not a ton, again, not a ton in these little packages. <clears throat> so there we go. Chicken Creole with brown rice. Definitely smell that tomato. As I was uh, traying it there. <clears throat> Let's see what else we got here. There's some peppers. Trying to find the chicken. There's a piece of chicken. Not a ton of chicken. Well, for the first bite, I'm going to just kind of try and get, you know, one of those ultimate bites. A little bit of everything. Now, this is pretty hot, <laughs> so <laughs> wish me luck. There's a picture of our little bite. There's the chicken right there at the end. Oh, yeah. That's hot. <laughs> huh. Okay. So... First impression, it's very thick. Definitely a lot of tomato taste there. The rice is uh, kind of mushy. <clears throat> I don't know, all I'm sort of getting is tomato. So... It's just, just very tomato-y. Reasonably well seasoned though. Doesn't really need the salt or pepper. It's not spicy by any stretch. It's just, uh, huh. It's underwhelming, I guess. I'm going to add a little bit of hot sauce just to <clears throat> kick it up a little bit. But yeah, I mean, I, I don't know. It's just kind of tomato. <laughs> it's just kind of tomato and rice. So I can't say I'm... I was actually looking forward to this one. And I'm, I'm kind of... I'm, I'm actually kind of disappointed now. If we're being honest with each other. Not a little piece of chicken. Chicken's kind of dry. Yeah, a little bit of Tabasco does kind of give it a... Kind of another flavor. Yeah, wow, that chicken is dry. Woo! That's a dry bird. <clears throat> Excuse me. I know everybody likes when I clear my throat on videos. <laughs> Little bit of bit of chicken. I mean, it's just it's cooked. It's a it's a meal. It's a hot meal. If I were super super hungry, I wouldn't throw it away. But uh, you know, it's 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 fine. It's just not great. It's rice and tomato sauce with dry chicken. 
So anyway, I'm going to give up. <laughs> and after, I'm going to clean my plate here. Definitely edible, but, uh, but anyway, guys, thank you very much for stopping by. I appreciate everyone's support. Uh, thank you so much for, uh, you know, subscribing. All of you people that have subscribed, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and check all the links down in the description. Hit the like button. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. And uh, I will be back for another, uh, another video next week. You guys have a great rest of your day. See ya.